Hey, DP, I'm Connor. And I'm Kira. DP News starts now. Holiday package is right around the corner, DP. Tickets will be sold all week outside the athletics office. Tickets are $5, so be sure to buy as soon as possible because there is limited seating and tickets will sell out fast. You don't want to miss all the hilarious sketches, singing, improv and of course, the male ballet. Speaking of the holidays, because it's the season of giving, we are having our annual can, toy, and penny drives. You can donate cans or non-perishable items, or toys, puzzles, and games that will go directly to the Unity Shop. You can drop off your donations at the marked bins at four locations, by the attendance office, by the front office, P2, or in the Career Center. And don't forget that the winner of the penny drive will receive a pizza party, and the second, third, and fourth place winners will receive a snack party. In other theater news, Legally Blonde is this year's spring musical. Anyone who's interested in auditioning, please go pick up the audition form in the EPAC by the bulletin board. Audition forms to participate for the cast are due next Thursday, December 11th, and audition forms for crew interviews are due Tuesday, December 9th. Anyone without an audition form with a signed signature will not be allowed to participate, so be sure to pick up audition forms today. Auditions will be December 15th and 16th from 3 to 6 in the EPAC. Seniors, you can still submit baby ads to be featured in the yearbook. Get your materials in by sending them to babyads at dpnews.org. And if you have not yet bought an ad, visit the business office to purchase one. The deadline for ads is next Friday, December 12th, so make sure to get everything submitted by then. Also, don't forget to buy your yearbooks before the price goes up. Remember, DP, Replace the Race is happening Monday night, December 8th, in the library at 7. Mr. Woodard, Scott Gutentag, teachers and counselors will be discussing the homework policy, the new ballot schedule, and Common Core. Also on Monday is Single Track High, an entertaining and inspirational film that focuses on six mountain bike riders of various skill levels and backgrounds. This film will be shown in the EPAC at 7 p.m. and is free for students. A $5 suggested donation for, is for adults. Speaking of rides, for anyone who rides bus number 2740, since the beginning of the school year, the morning booster route for 2740 from Elwood has been running 10 minutes later than the published scheduled time. But beginning on Monday, the bus will now operate on the published schedule time, which means it will be running 10 minutes earlier than it has been for the past three months. So be sure to get there on time if you want the ride. This Sunday, December 7th, the DP Jazz Combo will be the special guest at the Santa Barbara Jazz Society's monthly jazz party at Soho from 1 p.m. to 4 p.m. The combo will be performing at 145, and the entire DP Jazz program will be presented with a $1,000 scholarship. Be sure to go support our fellow DP Jazz combo this Sunday at Soho. Also next Tuesday, December 9th, is the annual winter concert featuring orchestra, advanced jazz, intermediate jazz, and DP's new freshman jazz, comprised of students from the freshman seminar music class. The concert starts at 7 p.m. in the EPAC with a free admission, but a $5 suggested donation is suggested in order to help support this awesome program. <laughs> Today in the Greek, we have a holiday-themed musical chairs. Here's a video with more info. <laughs> Come to the cafeteria today at lunch to play musical chairs. With holiday music. Let's do this. Woo! Ow. <laughs> it's not. Well, that's all the news we have for you today, DP. I'm Connor, and, and before I we go... Sorry, Kara. <laughs> before we go, I would like to wish a very happy birthday to our producer, the woman who is on a paper thin edge with me right now. I think she's going to punch me in the face when this cast is over. Honestly, I don't know how she puts up with either of us. Last week, I talked to her for 15 minutes about fudge. She still listens to me talk about my bear app. Happy birthday to Mason Rosenley. Now over to Ashley with sports. Good morning, DP. I'm Ashley Cockham with your sports report. Tuesday, boys basketball took on San Luis Obispo for their first game of the season. The boys defeated San Luis by one point with a score of 40-39. to Great job, boys. Girls soccer had a game yesterday against Moore Park and ended up with a score of 1-1. to Junior Becca Barato scored the tying goal from a throw-in from junior Malia Morales. Great way to start the season, ladies. 
For tennis, doubles team Casey Egger and Katie Yang won four rounds in CIF. They advanced to the round of 16, and this is the first time in DP history a DP tennis player has reached this level of play. They play at Seal Beach today at 11. Good luck, ladies. Today and tomorrow, wrestling has a tournament at Pioneer Valley High School. Good luck, guys. Tomorrow, girls water polo has a game against, at 11 here at our pool against Foothill. This game should be a great game, so come check it out. In other sports news, boys golf tryouts are on December 9th, 11th, and 16th. That's all I have for you today, DP.